Mushroom packaging is a home compostable alternative to synthetic foams like expanded polystyrene, polyethylene, and polypropylene. Petrochemical based foam packaging is contaminating our earth, and we've made it our mission to offer truly sustainable replacements. To make mushroom packaging, we use two inputs agricultural byproducts like corn stalks and the root structure of mushrooms called mycelium. No petrochemicals or plastics are needed. This combination of mycelium and agricultural waste forms a biocomposite that we call mycofoam. Our unique factories are a mix of advanced automation and specialized indoor farming techniques. This amazing living material binds together to form any custom molded shape engineered to protect your product. After we finish growing packaging parts, which only takes a couple of days, they are heat treated to stop the growth process and ensure no spores or allergens are produced. These sustainable, high performing parts are safe and ready for shipment. Mushroom packaging is used today to protect many products, including sensitive electronics and heavy furniture. When customers get mushroom packaging, they can compost it at home or at industrial composting facilities. The natural materials in mushroom packaging will add nutrients to the soil. Mushroom packaging does not biodegrade in use. Ecovative's team of engineers, biologists, material scientists, package designers, and production experts continues to innovate every day. We've developed a unique turnkey production system and we're continuously improving the performance of mushroom packaging. Today, there's no excuse for polluting our planet with packaging that isn't compostable. Mushroom packaging helps companies around the world to eliminate wasteful plastic foams. Mushroom packaging isn't just good for our planet, but it's high performing, cost competitive, and will leave a great first impression on your customers. So if you or your customers are still using plastic foams, we'd like to help you make the switch to mushroom packaging.